know what they're really saying. <laughs> Why, they're saying, friend, what you do doesn't matter. Friend, you're being taken through a fool. Better than a slave. Well, Possession now turns machine and man into allies. Hold and release to create a ghostly trap. You hold on to this. Sorry, I didn't. It's all right. It's as much a mystery to me as anyone else. Maybe Songbird knows, but he's not talking. I'm sorry. What for? I get to wear this stylish thimble to cover up my hideous deformity. I hear they're all the rage in Paris.
You must think me some sort of freak. A girl who can bring dead men back to life. Whose only acquaintance is a, a giant bird creature. I must seem ridiculous. You just got dealt a bad hand. I am not going back to that tower no matter what happens. They won't stop until they have. Why? What did I do to them? You frightened them. Good. This is what they want, brothers. To keep you so hungry, you can't speak but to them. To keep you so ignorant, you can't think of solutions to all your problems. To keep you chasing that almighty silver eagle so you can buy everything they're selling to keep you down. But Daisy Fitzroy says there's another way. These people another are like way this coming of real soon. Maybe Daisy's right. Maybe she should pay him back for all of this. Not before she pays us. We're here for guns and then the airship. I guess we could head straight for the police station. Or see what's in that bar. What do you think? Back it up, see if it best! Ah! 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 pinned down!
in the sky in the sky Or there's a lockpick over there. When you force deep underground, well, you see things from the bottom up. And down at the bottom of the city, I saw a fire burning. A fire's got heat of plenty, but it ain't got no mouth. Daisy. Now she got herself a mouth big enough for all the fires in Colombia. There's the impact. We're gonna have to get through an army to get those tools. Was making weapons for the Vox. I squashed that gunsmith like a bug. <laughs> <laughs> Grizzly traps around the lines up here. 
idea was to to bleed one of your couriers till he gave you up. Except, of course, you're using kids now. Now I got this tiny engine boy eyeballing me. Go ahead. Try to take his leg off. Lying here between us. I sure wish he'd cry or something. Sorry. Here you go. Nice. Take a look at this lock. Done. Shift while they're, they're just folk. Well, I guess I fell into the goddamn bottle because I stumbled back without the evidence locker key. <laughs> if Schmidt finds out, well, there'll be hell to pay.
right up your alley. Give me a second. Ready. Argued something fierce at night, Lady Comstock and a prophet. Could never make out what it was about from my bunk, though. After the worst, I seen she ain't left for morning prayer. So I crept upstairs to check in on her. And like a fool, I lingered. Scullery maid was what they called me when I walked in. Now we just have to get them back to the Vox, and then we get our airship. Picked. Really? That little old lock. There. Who are we really helping by getting guns for the Vox Populi? It's gonna help us. Daisy can make a change, can't she? Make things better for the people here. Sure. We sure as hell aren't going to be able to carry all this back to the shop. God, we didn't think this all the way through. What is that? It looks like a tear. To a, another version of this room that doesn't have any tools in it. Well, if the tools aren't in there, then... Then they must be back, back at, at the, the shop. shop. Booker, if we go into this tear... I don't think there's any turning back. Are you sure you want to go now? Do it. Well, that did something. Come on, let's head back to the gunsmith and finish our deal. I aim to be on that airship and well shut of this place for a long. Booker, if the Vox get their weapons, there's going to be a revolution just like Les Miserables. These people are gonna have better lives. Yeah. I don't want to be a part of it. Once we get our airship, we'll be well shut of this place.
Poster. In this world, you're a hero. I remember I led the Vox. S Slate and I burned down the Hall of Heroes. Booker. The nerves. Hard to think. There's two memories in the same Booker, place. Booker, come back to me. We're going to find Daisy Fitzroy. And we're getting out of here on the First Lady. Let's go. In order to feed my Delivering a tornado blow. Hold and release to build up a more devastating tornado blow.
don't know if I brought us to a world where the Vox had weapons. Or I created one. Did I just bring us to a world where Chenlin was alive, or, or did I create it? I told you I always thought that my little trick was a form of wish fulfillment. I got my wish. Looks like I got a friend in town after all. Slate. He's fell in with these Vox Populi. And for irregulars, I will say, they are loaded for bear. Problem is, I gotta help them with their damn revolution first. Then we take Comstock House by storm. I do that, I get the girl. Get that door open unless someone takes that airship out.
sabotage the engine and bring this thing down. Sabotage the engine and bring this thing down. Okay, now to get off this thing. We need to take that elevator up. Please, the Fink's office. Just right for each other, aren't they? Who? That's Roy and Comstock. <laughs> May Lynn? Mr. Lynn? My god, I. I was so set on getting to Paris. I, I didn't really think that. You couldn't have known this would happen. I had a role in this catastrophe. If, if you want to pretend that we're purely innocents in this, then that's your prerogative, but... Um, uh, hello? Fink? I saw you die, Booker. Saw it with my own eyes. That's right. Listen, I got you your guns. I'm here for my airship. But my Booker DeWitt died for the Vox Populi. You either an imposter or a ghost. My Booker DeWitt was a hero to the cause, a story to tell your children. You, 
You just complicate the narrative. have shown me yet another wonder, though I've yet to see the application for it. They illuminate a merger of machine and man that is somehow the lesser yet the greater of both parties. The process seems to be irreversible. <laughs> Perhaps, though, Comstock will have some need of this kind of thing to keep watch in that tower he is building. Elizabeth. I can do that. All done. Huh? <laughs> 
Thanos. That'll do. It? Is this your movement, Daisy? This is what needs to be done. You see, the founders ain't nothing but weeds. Cut them down and they just grow back. If you want to get rid of the weed, you got to pull it up from the root. It's the only way to be... <laughs> Talk to me. 